Today we're talking about Budget Beast. I got the best guys that you guys should have on your team. I'm talking the best bang for your buck. Now, as you guys are seeing this, I am on vacation. So you should be seeing this on Monday. And if there's content that came out on Monday, they're not going to be a part of this list. So there might be some studs there, but we'll have another one of these videos later on in the week or early next week. But if you guys do enjoy these types of videos, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, drop a like down below, and hit me up with a comment. Now to start things off, we're talking about 84 Devin Hester. Now currently his price is sitting around 100k, but later in the week or around next legend drop, his price is going to drop a lot, okay? Especially on that Saturday when people are ripping those promo packs, he's going to drop. The reason why I think he's a must-have is because of his speed. He's got 85 speed, 85 acceleration, 81 short route running, 79 medium route running, and 83 deep route running. So he is very, very good for an 84 overall, just with his speed alone. He's one speed less than Tyree Kill, and he's only an 84. So this card, I feel like, is a must. Now, obviously, with abilities, he's not going to be able to get anything. If you don't want to get that full one right now and spend the 400,000 coins that he cost, you can get this guy for a quarter of the price next we're going to be talking about a quarterback for you guys this one you get for completely free which makes him the ultimate budget beast and this is bryce young so the reason why bryce young is so good in this game is his ability so you'll be able to get two of them on there you can get quick draw and what a lot of people have been doing is running quick draw with gift wrapped so three ap gift wrapped and quick draw if you watched any of the pro scene on saturday Sunday for the ladders, you will see some guys using Bryce Young 3 AP with gift wrapped and quick draw. The reason with quick draw, sometimes it will feel like he has gunslinger when he's under pressure. The ball will come out super, super fast. It makes it really nice for a free card. It's not that bad at all. And then even later on, you're going to be able to upgrade him to an 86 overall, which is going to bump his stats up. I don't know if he's going to get any more abilities once you bump him up, but either way, as of right now, like this card is perfectly fine for, for you to have in the game and he's completely free. And you don't need him to be an 86 to be able to get the quick draw and the gift wrapped on him. I think this card is definitely a stud, man. So if you're struggling with a quarterback, just grind to get this guy. I believe you get him at level 8 or level 7 in the field pass. I can't remember, so don't quote me on that. But get him and you'll be all right. Next, we're going to be talking about another free card you can get, which is Odell Beckham Jr. This card has been playing for me. I have him on my plus 25 Browns theme team. He's only in an 82, but he's 83 speed. 84 on my team with the plus one. He's really, really good, man. I can't wait to get this next upgrade for him. So whenever we're able to get that, he's definitely staying on the field. This card has been really, really solid. Runs routes great, catches everything, really liking it. And for completely free, man, you need three wide receivers most of the time. This card is a must-have for any budget team. Moving over next, A, is another legend, okay? 84 Ed Reed coming in at 84 speed, which is really good. Now, if you run... If you run a Ravens theme team, Texans theme team, you'll be able to get them to 85 speed just for running plus 25, which is nice. But the reason why I like this card a lot is his 84 has 85 zone, which is really, really good. I like this card a lot. I've tried all these cards just messing around in house rules, and they all played really, really good for me. His price is, it came down a little bit. It's already at 70,000, and it's continuing to drop. 50,000, 60,000, worth it in my opinion for an 84. When you look at other players like this card right here, Kevin Byard going for 55,000 with 83 speed, less zone, Ed Reed is on top. Definitely grab that 84 Ed Reed when you can if you don't have the full one already. Now, I want to talk about halfbacks. If you guys have your rookie premieres, obviously you got the DeAndre Swift for free, but if you guys have your rookie premieres, this guy seems really, really good, okay? Now, he's got 85 speed. That's why I like him more than B. John Robinson. B. John Robinson is 84 speed. He's got 84 cod, 84 break tackle, decent spin move, decent juke move, 83 carrying. Like, this card is pretty good, man. I played a couple PlayStation kids. I don't have my rookie premieres yet, but I played a couple PlayStation kids that had this guy, and he was running rampant. So, yeah, I definitely like this guy, and I've been hearing good things about him. He's completely free. Now, if you did not get him, okay, so who you can get is this guy right here. He's pretty similar. 84 Fred Taylor. He's already at 54,000 coins, which is pretty cheap. And these guys are going to continue to go down, especially with the next Legend release. But 84 Fred Taylor, 84 speed. Or you can use B. John Robinson, but if you don't have any Rick Premieres, get Fred Taylor. 84 speed, 86 juke move, 85 cod, which is good. 85 spin move. This card has been really, really solid. I mean, for 50K, you kind of can't beat it. Last up, we're going to be talking about this guy right here. Now, what makes this guy so good is if you grab Team Captain Rondé Barber and put him on one side, 
you can pick up this 84 Sherman and put him on the other and be just fine. This Sherman's got 84 speed, 85 cod. He's got 86 zone, which is nice. He doesn't have really high man, but Sherman is a zone corner. This card is going to play very, very good for you. All these legends with these 84s just for future, like some of them are going to be studs. Obviously, like Javon Curse, not really good, stuff like that. But when you get guys like this, you can plug these guys in your lineup. They're going to play just fine, and they're half the they're quarter of the cost of the full legend. So let's take a look at what this Sherman is costing right now. He's already down to 69000 So by the time you guys see this video, man, the prices are just going to continue to drop for these guys. So get them while you can if you need another corner. I would play him on the outside. I wouldn't play him at the slot. But yeah, he's going to be an absolute goon for you, man. Now, I have two more options for you as well. Maybe you don't want that Sherman. Well, maybe you want this J.C. Horn, who's only going for less than 50,000 coins. 85 speed, 84 zone. Good card, man. I use him on my team currently. He's been really, really good, and his price is just continuing to drop. When we get Headliners Part 2, his price is going to drop even more. So if you don't have this card, highly suggest you picking him up. He's a budget beast. And the last and final one, Kadarius Tony, 85 speed. You can get him or the card we just talked about for free from the field pass, okay? You can get them for free. From the comp pass, you can get them for free. And head house rules that were missing rewards, but you can get him for free from there as well. So once we get those, you can grab those two and be set. Now, this Kadarius Tony, he's a return kick specialist. So even if you maybe your team's decked out and you need somebody else, just take this card, put him in kick returner, punt returner. He'll, he will get some kickoff touchdowns for you, man. 85 speed, 88 acceleration, 88 agility. He's really shifty. 89 juke move and 90 cod. That's what makes him so shifty is this 90 cod. Currently, I have an 85 overall team. He's my kick returner because he's that good. That's going to do it for the Budget Beast video. We will have another one of these if you guys actually enjoyed it. Any other videos you guys want to see, drop a comment down below and we will make it happen. Now, I do want to talk to you guys about content, okay? So Thursdays when content comes live. So we're probably going to get Headliners Part 2 on Thursday. If there's any 84s you want from the last part or any of the 87s, that's going to be the time to buy them. Within the first hour of it going live, you can get stuff cheap. Everybody's buying packs, buying bundles, and flooding the market house with them, and people are posting them, just cutting each other down. You know what I mean? You can get these guys a lot cheaper. So same thing with Legends. Just realize they tweeted out what's coming out. If you guys don't um, follow them on Twitter, follow me on Twitter. I usually post them on there too, and you'll be able to get an idea on what's coming so you know what you want, and then you can just get it that time and just wait for the right price. So make sure you're just being smart with your coins. You don't need all the best players in the game. The reason why I do, obviously, is because I'm a content creator and I make a lot of content for you guys. Otherwise, I would use the 84 Hester, the Sherman, stuff like that, just stacking my coins until there was a card I really, really wanted. So just be smart. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace out.